have the craziest idea today. Yeah, this one might be insane, but there may be a little truth to it. A lot of you guys are telling me to go back to the farm and to load in the cabin house because there might be a brand new secret along with it. So today, that's what we're going to do, everyone. And right now, down below in the comments, have you ever been to a farm? And do you ever want to go to a farm? Tell me right now and leave a like while you're at it and share this video around so more people can see it. And remember, watch to the end because you never know what we might find or might what might happen. Because crazy stuff happens on public servers, everyone. You know that. So right now, we're heading to the Brookstaven Stables. Yeah, that's right. Did I say Brook Stables? Stables? I think I did. But well, let's go over here and see the farm. We're going to load a house right next to it. And you guys already know, once you load a house in, you get an awesome tree house, which is super cool. So at least even if we fail at finding anything, we get a tree house with us. So the reason why we keep going back to the cabin house is because... There might be a super big secret because in the icon of the game, you can actually see Mr. Brookhaven in the upper window. Yeah, you can see it. It's crazy. I know. Okay, so we're going to start right here. We got this whole thing loaded in. Maybe we should start over here or maybe we should start up there. I honestly don't know where we should begin. So where we're going to start with is probably the smartest choice inside the water because that's where a lot of secrets have been lately. And you never know what we might find down there. Okay, Dokali, here we are. Oh, yeah, we need a flashlight too. There is no way to see anything down here. Ah, yes, beautiful. So currently we can't go through any of the walls. And I say currently because I think Wolfpack is now... Holding off on some ideas and some secrets because we're finding them so fast. He doesn't know what to do anymore Okay, so this is the suspicious spot right here that everyone keeps telling me to go back to first of all I want to say there is no button on this and the reason why I can click right now is because I have the flashlight You know selected we only undo it nothing's there so we're gonna go on this side now and also see there is nothing here, and I know you guys are saying that right there is a button, and I can promise you right now that is not a button, and also the light is not clickable. If it was clickable, that would be super duper sweet. Maybe there's something we need to activate to make it happen, because remember, in the agency place, you have to activate another thing to make this work. So that tells you something, maybe we need something else to make this work. And if we go into the water and drop down a bed into this, just like that, or in any way possible, and we look inside, you're going to notice that there is nothing down here. And also, for some weird reason, this is a chunk, and then there's a second one right there. Why is there two chunks? That is always what everyone's questioning, because there shouldn't be two of them when this area is supposed to be 100% all together. So if we do this, and we zoom out a lot, you're not going to see anything. But right down here, it's a little suspicious, because it actually separates. Why does it separate? There is also this little weird thing right here. You guys can see it. Is it the end of the water? Probably. But it might also be something else. As you see, we're under the map right now, and I'm not seeing anything crazy at the farm as of yet. But that doesn't mean there isn't anything down here. So we're going to have to... You know what? I am not taking any chances. We're going to do this. We're going to open this. And I'm going to jump. Oh, we survived. Never mind. Okay, we're good. We're great. And if we want to, we can actually shrink down or even just walk into here like this. There's a little secret for you guys that you did not know existed. Yeah, you can literally hide inside here or you can be burnt. I don't think you want to be burnt. No one wants to be burnt. No one wants to have to see a burnt person or something. You know, you, know I mean? you know what I mean? In this right here, you can also hide in. But the weirdest part of this, okay, so as you realize, I can go through this tree, this tree, this tree, and even this tree right here. And I can even go through this one and e not not this one. But if you guys realize this one, you can climb up and do something, which is really cool. So that this rises the question. Why can we go through all of these, even poles, even poles, guys, if we can't go through, I'm going through all of them just to show you, that we can't go through this tree. Why is this one in particular different? Because look at this guy. I want to make it clear to you. Lights aren't solid. They are not solid. So the biggest thing right now is this. You guys are still saying you can click this and do stuff. I have yet to find what I need to activate to do it. So we might actually try something in a, a really shortly because we never know what might activate it. So if we go over here, this is also can go through, go through here, and now we're inside. And if you grab this book, nothing happens, but sometimes you glitch. And someone told me to look behind here and check where the picture is. 
that there's a secret under here, and as you guys see right now, there is not one there. Yep, so far all the secrets you said at the farm have not been true. Okay, okay, so now we're in this room. As you realize, you can go in here, you can go over there like this, like that. And this is solid, so you know you can't go through it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a dumb and turn the water on just because. See, you can't even click it. See, it looks like you can, but when you try to activate it, nothing happens. And by the way, I love the color of the walls. And the other suspicious thing is this mirror right here. If you guys did not realize, this mirror is different than this mirror. Yep. And this mirror generally has like a secret of its own because if you go to the mayor's office, there's things like this too. But if we turn off the lights, yes, this one right here. Can we turn it off from here? No, where is the, where is the, where is the thing on the wall? There we go. So if we turn off all of the lights, nothing happens. Nothing at all. If we turn, do this like that, nothing happens as well. So that means there is nothing there currently. But if we go boom and boom, nothing's outside as well. So, one other thing is, you guys keep telling me to check behind the- I don't know why the TVs are also what you guys want me to check behind, but there's never anything behind the TVs. You guys can see right now, I am doing this. It turns it on, but that is it. Yep. Yeah, you heard it right. That is all it does. No, I do not want to paint a picture. We're going to go up the wrong side, and now we're going to go up here to check even further. So, up here, there are not many secrets that you can probably know. The safe is literally right in front of your face, and you can't hide in here. But it has a very nice lighting system on the top. But if you guys realize, this right here is the window where Mr. Brookhaven or the FBI agent hides. And there is a camera right there. What does that mean by the camera literally right there? Probably nothing. But if you look like this, you'll see that Mr. Brookhaven could 100% look out this window. But there is nothing for him to hide behind. So that rises more questions, especially like stuff like this. Why is this up here if it's not actually important? What else can we find? I honestly don't know. We're going to head outside now and see what's out there. Okay, now that we're outside, we're going to start with the farm just because this may have some new secrets because we loaded this in. So far, that is solid. That is solid. I don't remember these being solid, guys. Do you guys remember that? I remember them. You can actually go through them, but now we can't. So now after we're done with that, we go up here, we look around, and I'm not seeing any buttons. They are generally more noticeable than you may assume because they would like be a little bit like uh, like pushed out and there's nothing there and the lights honestly don't do anything either. So we're done with that and we're going to check this. This is also solid. We're also going to check those over there. That's solid. And this right here is also solid and nothing is hidden inside them at all. But if you go behind it, you will see that you can actually get on this roof somehow. It may not look like it, but just watch right now. Okay, so... If you want to get on top of this roof, it's very easy. And honestly, a lot of people always are questioning why. Why can we go on top of this roof if there is nothing there to find? Why would this become a thing? As you realize, there's a little branch right there. We can go on top of it. And now we're on top of this. So I am also going to give a few more. Is that just a tree? Yeah, that's just a tree. I saw, I didn't see the top part. I just saw the trunk. But there's uh, some other things I want to show you guys right now. So what we need to do next is get on top of this house and I'll show you what we're going to be doing. So there is another little secret that no one can explain and it doesn't make any sense. We need a ladder for this. We're going to grab the ladder, place it down, jump up, jump up, and jump up again. So we're up here now and I want to show you guys something. We're going to have to go back up here when we do this. But right now we drop down. You guys saw that right there, right? You saw it. You, you understand it. Now we go up here again. We're going this way this time, and there's a car behind my house. Uh, as I guys said, it's the weird stuff that happens here. So once we're up here, you should be able to get on top of this tree. Is it this tree, or is it? It's one of these trees over here that the tr on top of it, it is actually solid. Okay, that's not the tree. One of the trees. Oh, what is this guy doing? Where? What? Is he in my house? What are you doing here? Oh gosh, I don't know why there's a random person at my house, but. On top of one of these trees right here, which I always seem to forget, a bunch of my fans found it, and I have yet to actually look at it myself. It's one of these ones, and I can't remember which one it is. But you're, you're seeing the cursor right now. You cannot actually click. So I, I'm sorry for whoever was I'm confusing, but we're done with that. We're going to do this. I'm going to jump up here again like that. There we go. And once we're up here, we need to get ourselves to, I think... Is it that tree over there? I, I think it might be. 
Let's go. Let's put this right there. Drop that down. And oh no. Oh wait, wait. Yeah, that's a tree. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Oh, we can't get up there. Let's let's make this a little bit higher to make it a lot more easier for me. Okay. There we go. We're zoomed out so much that I can't even see. So we go right here. And okay, that's not the tree that has the solid. So one of these trees over here have the solid, and I'm having a lot of trouble getting to it. I don't know why, but one of the trees right there is solid. So that was the other theory that someone was going around with saying, why is the tree solid? It should not be solid. There is no rhyme or reason for it. Okay, let's try this. Can we can we actually achieve the goal we want? Yaka! Yeah, oh. Oh, yeah, yep. So this tree is also a lot bigger than the others. And there might be something up inside of it. But currently there isn't. And before we end everything, you guys would not be happy if I did not load in the Dakota Trail. Why this one? Because it goes with the theme. Yep, and now watch everything load in around me. And you're not going to see much changes. Including over here. Nothing changes over here as well. But it is very interesting to load this in because... Did that guy actually load in a, a bed behind my thing? A tent? He did. He literally loaded in a tent behind me. So we have this all surrounding here. We have nothing out there. And we have nothing in here. Is the guy just living in my house? He probably is. And we go over here. There is also still nothing inside. But it is worth a check just to see. So guys, as you realize, I have tested a lot of theories today to see if any of them are true. So thank you all for watching. Thank you all for being here. Remember to comment, like, and share. And you know what to do. Yeah, you know what to do. You, you just leave a comment right now saying you made it to the end. Or you can say farm down below in the comments. That shows you made it to the end. Thank you all for watching. And bye-bye.